I'm going to show you how to transform any cheap putter into a triple track putter for six bucks. What's happening Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. I like to golf every now and then and I will tell you these golf balls by Callaway, triple track golf balls have these lines on them. I've actually shown you in another video how to replicate these lines, but they are awesome. You kind of use them to line up your putts and they have really changed my golf game. It's amazing how much they help you stay on line and get putts close. So these are great and an easy modification you can make to any golf ball, but putters that have the triple track lines are really expensive. Now this one is just a really cheap bullet putter. This is like 20 or $24, it's really inexpensive. And I got it because it has some lines on here which work generally pretty well with the triple track lines. I, I've done a video on that and I just wanna show you here, if I just hold this triple track ball up to the camera, you can see that these lines, while they work, and I can tell if they're not aligned or not, you know, it would be better if they were exactly the same well, color, as well as distance from each other as the triple track golf ball. So enter this little device. It's a triple track sticker. Now, I'm pretty sure that these aren't officially licensed by anyone and there's a couple of people that make them, but it looks like it's just a piece of vinyl with the lines stuck on it. Now I wanna show you here, this is an official Callaway triple track ball. And if I hold this sticker up to it, you can see that it is a perfect representation. The lines are the same distance, same thickness, and same color. Now, what you can do is take a cheap putter like this. You do have to have a flat area where you can put it on there. I've noticed that some have like a tapered area. I'm sure you can trim it with a little pair of these. So that's what we're gonna do here. I'm actually gonna go ahead and trim this right to the lines, remove the sticker from the backing. And now I'm gonna go ahead and take this cheap putter and go ahead and line this up right with the center line there and lay the sticker down. Now you can get really fastidious about that and make sure that it's pressed into all these little ridges and everything like that. And you could decide to wrap it down like this and wrap it all the way around the bottom. I'm gonna do that just for simplicity here. And then I'm just gonna cut off the excess and you could trim this any way you want. Now I'm gonna remove the backing. So I've got it on there and now what you can see here is I have a compatible triple track putter so those lines match up perfectly now a couple things i want to point out about this is the sticker here is like a printed vinyl and it's pretty thin it kind of reminds me of like packaging tape in some ways however the adhesive on it is not super super strong and so if you don't want this to be permanent on your putter you can definitely remove it like you can see right here even on these flat surfaces this is a little bit of textured surface but even on these flat surfaces it peels away and doesn't seem to leave any residue now the pro con of that is that i don't know that this is going to be a super durable install but if you don't like it you can also remove it so that's kind of nice but i really think it's pretty clever that for you know six bucks you can pick up a sticker like this use the triple track golf balls and possibly improve your putting game substantially so i'll be using it trying it out but uh, I just wanted to show you how to make this modification on your own. Hey, if you want to pick up one of these stickers, I'll put a link to it in the description below. Peter Von Panda, out.